<laughs> Let's play! Whoa! I don't know why the game's not showing up when it should have, uh... Oh, well, there it is. Decided to play a little hide-and-seek there with me. Hello there, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to another stream of Earth Defense Force 5, where all we do is blast the living hell out of bugs and aliens. Humanoid aliens that look like frogs, but that's... But that's something else entirely. See, I haven't played this game in a little while, and it's like, hey, let's, let's go back into it a little bit, you know? I'm still deciding if I really want to keep playing the whole game, but we'll see. I'm enjoying it for what it is still. And hello there, Ichigo. Uh, yeah, we're hoping we're not going to drop frames either here. Uh, so yeah, new configuration settings for my stream, so it should look a lot prettier, should look a lot cleaner. Here's hoping for the best. Um... And yeah, we'll just go ahead and get started here. I'm going to have to remember how to play a little bit because it's been a little while. But uh, we are still playing as a ranger, which I'm going to stick to. And I think the minion uh, Buster Burst is still the best assault rifle I want to use. And I'm sticking with my one-shot sniper rifle because this thing is insanely powerful. Um, <clears throat> and uh, yeah... Yeah, I think we're good. We'll just go ahead and get started. This is mission 32. Oh boy, we got a while to go. Large amount of monsters are confirmed to appear out of the cave we found. It's likely the monsters reproduce deep underground. It's too dangerous to leave it that way. Let's commence Operation Cave Invasion now. While invading the nest, the first risk you may face is encountering alien sentinels again at the location where you ran into a horde of monsters last time. Operation Stage 1, the Vanguard, should lead and take out the enemy sentinels. After the place is secure, head deep uh, into the nest and eliminate the monsters, making way for our follow-up forces. So this is Stage 1 of this cave invasion. God knows how many it's going to be, but we're doing on hard, and let's just keep going. We have arrived at the destination. Great. Ooh. Investigate the uh. insides of the cave. Charge in. Oh, wait. Back. I see that guy. Boom! He's still alive. Wait, what type of alien is he? Oh, he's not that. He's not that bad. There you go. Let's get him out of the way. Now we just clean up the uh, uh, these guys. Thank God, there's no fall damage, right? It's like this game can be brutal enough as it is. So it's like, uh, don't, don't, don't make it worse for me. And the hell are the other ones at? I killed one. Where, where is he? You guys get him? I got him. Nice. Whew. Might as well also finish reloading of the sniper rifle I'm at it. So I know we just started. How's everything looking, guys? Does it look a little bit cleaner? Does it look better? I don't know. Are they still calling me newbie in this game? These bastards. I like single-handedly handled so much in this game. They're like, oh, watch out, game. newbie. It's like, you know what? You know what? Wrong from the start. Looks crisp. Yay. Let's hope it, st it stays crisp. So yeah, like the minion burster, it's not fully automatic. It's a, it's a three-shot burst. But the thing is, is like, what happens, like, it, it leeches on, or, like, latches on to the monsters, and then the three projectiles burst on impact. Now, each impact is, like, 80 or so damage, which is that's pretty damn nice, honestly. Um, and it, it, it could decimate whatever's in its way. I don't, you know, I'll be honest with you guys, I don't even know what the hell I'm shooting at right now. Uh... Like, this tactic, I don't, I don't know if you want to call it a tactic, strategy, whatever, but it's like, I'm trying to, like, say, hey, this is kind of like a bottleneck, right? And maybe it allows me to not get too overwhelmed or too hurt, although I'm taking a look at my health right now, and it's, it's pretty, I'm, I'm pretty ouched right now, <laughs> but uh, I think I'll be okay. And also, it's been a while since I've played this game, so I might be a little rusty, but at the same time, it's just shooting bugs 
I think I'll be okay after a little while, so. Although these spiders are one of the worst enemies for me in the game anyway, which is just because they're stupid webs. Not only do they slow you down, but they hurt you. So, there's that problem, but it looks like we're okay-ish. Although I don't know why the rest of my allies are behind me, not doing jack diddly anything. But whatever. Uh, hold on, sorry. I just want to quickly read the chat here. I missed something here. For some reason, I can't help but imagine me running up to Pharaoh and he, as he's shooting the bugs and asks, What do you think of the sauce? Before Pharaoh slaps me away saying, Get the stick out of my face. Uh, I mean, I don't mind helping people when, whenever, but it's like when I am focused on something, I, it's like I do ask. It's like, oh, no, please, just give me some time. You know, I'll, I'll help you later, but it's whatever. You know, the thing is, I, I hate bugs. Like, I mean, I wish I was more manly when it, when it came to bugs, but, you know, just to be completely honest here, I, I'm, I'm terrible when it comes to bugs and spiders, like, it's all, it's all a big nope for me. Like, I, I, I just can't deal with that. And it sucks, you know, but... I don't know, you, you know, there's a statement like, Oh, you, be a man, kill the bugs. And it's like, screw you, you kill the bugs. I ain't touching that thing. It, it's weird. And sometimes I feel like it comes in, like, waves. Like, sometimes I'm like, oh, I'm okay. It's not a big of a deal. Other times I'm like, no, bug! I think there's like a certain threshold, like depending on the size, is like once it's like kind of a too big for me, it's like nope. Other times like it's like ah, it's not that bad. It's it's fine, but I don't know. Spiders are always a big nope for me. I I, I just nope nope with spiders. And I know like you know they're like oh spiders are your friends they. They, they help keep up, keep out the nasty other bugs out there. I'm like, well, that's cool, but I, like, it doesn't mean I want to see it. And then you know, there's always that statistic that uh, oh, but you eat bugs. Like I think on average, oh man, just like on average, a person eats like seven or eight spiders in their sleep because like you know, you're sleeping and I guess they crawl in your mouth and it's like, oops, you ate it. So they say. I, I don't know if that's more of an urban myth or if that's actual facts, but that's what I keep hearing. Hello there, Twitch. How are you doing today? Oh, wait, crap. There's one behind me. Perfect time to reload. So stupid, still, all my allies are just all the way in the back. The doing God knows what. They're certainly protecting the monsters. They plan to breed monsters. I'm doing pretty good. Just uh playing the some Earth Defense Force. As work. you see. Have just having fun. Ah. You're cooking meat without a shirt. Wish you luck. Oh boy, dude. Be careful, especially with the oil and whatnot. Because that can that hurts. Trust me, I know. So you're, so, you, so Justin, you're good with bugs. You, you used to catch them. See, I, I, I man, I, I mean, all the power to you, man. But I just, I, I can't do it. And maybe because like I never really was like a super outdoorsy guy. Um, I never got, I just never got the chance, you know. Like my family and I, like, we just never did the whole camping thing and fishing thing and hunting. We, we never did that. So, um, you know, a lot of my friends here are like, oh, the area, it's, just, it's not really built for outside activities, kind of like camping and hiking and all that. But, uh, eh, maybe, maybe just an excuse on my part. I don't know. Don't worry. I have no more bits. I can't donate 145 bits again. <laughs> it's okay, Twitch. Oh, it's just, it's, it's just an urban legend. Okay. Uh oh, it says I dropped a little bit of frames earlier, but it looks like we're still good. I wish I could just avoid dropping frames, period, but I don't know why 
It's like I, I now I always drop some sort of frames, and it's like I swear I wasn't like that before. Like, like I would go whole streams without dropping any frames, and now it's like, well, you're you're gonna drop a few here and there now. It's like well, that sucks. And then also, because uh, I was watching Dan's gaming, because he he was covering the Gamescom conference today, and I. And I'm not going to lie, part of me, I was in a stream earlier today just so I can cover it myself, too, with you guys. If the monsters um, are reproducing here, but I'm like, ah, screw it. Situation for mankind. Uh, Make sure to reach the deepest so I was watching his conf or his reactions to the game's kind of thing. And then afterwards, people were talking about internet speed and all that. Too. And... He was talking about like how you know obviously if people have if a company has a the monopoly in the area, tunnel, they'll jack up the prices and there's nothing you can do about it. But then I he didn't mention because I guess in Seattle where he is located and now I'm now I'm starting to realize that many other streamers are located or have moved to. Uh, there is no there's no uh, monopoly. Uh, for the internet service to provide, because there's like four or five people out there to provide internet. And... Oh man, hold on. This, this might get a little nasty. So... They have... He has Comcast, but there's no data cap for his service. And his speeds... He has gigabit speeds. So he has... A gigabyte upload, uh, download, and upload, which is insane and perfect for streaming. He has that for like 80 something a month, which is amazing. Now, you take that those same speeds anywhere else, not even the same speeds. I'll, I'll use I use myself for example. I recently just got unlimited data again, but for the most part, people have a data cap of a terabyte around here, and it's like that in a lot of places in the U.S. apparently, especially with Comcast or many other places. So it's a, a gigabyte data cap, and uh, with an upload speed of like, uh, what was it? Download speed is like maybe 75 to 100. And megabytes, I should say. And uh, what else? An upload speed of like 10 or 15. The same price that these other streamers pay in Seattle is the same price I pay for those speeds plus a data cap. And the reason being is like there's no other service provider in this area that can provide those means. And it's like... Well, that sucks, but unfortunately, that's how it, how it rolls sometimes, you know? Huh. Random right, question, but I know you and Binks are doing Apollo Justice. If you could date anyone in Ace Attorney, who would it be? Who? I don't know. I don't think I've ever asked that, if I've ever been asked that question before. So, I don't know. They all seem that they have their problems. I don't know if I would want to date any one of them. I don't know. If I, if, I, if, I, if, I, ugh, if I can think of an answer, I'll I'll let you know later. All right. I still feel like there's one behind me, but I guess we're okay. Already all above me. I gotta always watch out about that. Like it could be above me. Hold on a minute, guys. Is someone picking up the phone? Hold on one, one quick second, guys. Damn it. No, I missed it. Now I feel bad. Alright, never mind. That was a phone call, and... Well, it was a phone call. I just assumed somebody picked up the freaking phone, but... Uh, guys, hold on one second, actually. Give me one, another second.
Yay, interruption number one. Let's see how many that takes. Oh, sorry about that. <clears throat> uh, da, 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 da. I would probably date Mia. <laughs> Just because she has a lot of plot doesn't mean I would want to date her. No, not at all. <laughs> That's my go-to thing now. Like, uh, if a woman has large uh, assets, I'll just say, look at all that plot! And I think it's like more of a joke, like, when people say they watch certain anime or whatever, or certain games or movies for the plot. It's like, no, you're not, you perverted bastard. I'm, I'm being stupid now. Which is all the time. Now... Oh! Oh, it's... Ooh! Ouchies! That hurt! I was like, I see two something down here, but... Damn, that hurt quite a bit. Um... Look at all that plot! Alright. Who said that? Are they... Oh, no. Oh, that's why I got hurt so bad. It's a stupid, uh... Damn, damn, damn. Hold on. This is bad. It's a shotgun aliens that and they really really hurt son of a duck i may inadvertently die here because of the like a couple of hits from those guys and th that's it I, I would go down there and shoot them, but... And I, I think it's still both of them down there, too. God, it sounds like they're actually speaking English a little bit. Kind of creepy. Where the hell did you come from? Oh, uh, you know what? I'm not... Come on, run, damn you. Come on, go, go, go. I don't want to take that much of a risk. I'm gonna, actually going to go back here a little bit to pick up some health that I believe I left. <clears throat> Hello, Louisa. Welcome to the stream. I watch porn for the story, or I watch hentai for the art. You know there's people out there who say that, and it's like, nah. Yo, watch hentai for the story. Oh, yeah, okay, and I'm Santa Claus. What was the context of these phrases, Justin? <laughs> oh, because I think I initially said that, uh... Um... What did I say? <laughs> what did I say? Um... That... If a woman has large assets or big boobs in a, in a game or anything, I'm like, oh, look at all that plot! And it's like, yeah, people say they only play these games or whatever because, like, oh, it's a story. It's like, no, you don't. You know, I got so confused there, because I guess there's three of those guys down here. And I'm like, when I shot the sniper at them, I'm like, holy crap, I shot him so hard, he's split in two. That was not the case. It actually just was a second green thing. Hey there, Dusty. Welcome to the stream. How have you been? How's all the acting coming along? God knows I need to get my ass back into it as well. But I'll just for for just me, period. I just gotta get back to it. You guys are actually actively doing so. I just need to get it back into it, period. It's been a 
I can't even tell you the last time I did an audition or took a class or anything like that, unfortunately. But, uh, yep. Uh, there's... Where are all these bastards at? Now, is it somewhere around here? There he is. I didn't expect to see aliens here. The aliens seem to like it here. Do they want to hibernate? But they're extraterrestrial beings. Maybe they are actually subterranean beings. Wouldn't that be something? All right, before I continue, let me just take a quick take. Ugh, let me take a quick look at chat. I like that you said if a woman has big assets, but then you just want big old boobs. Hey, you know, you got use the political correct the political correct terms, and then just all out be blunt, I guess. Um, when I hear someone say those phrases, ask them why they like said things in more details and see how they react. Yeah, they're like, oh, well. well I mean, they, 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 don't know, they don't know what the hell they're going to say. Jolux Pox was your last audition, right? Oh, Justin, I think you're right. Um, That probably was my last audition for what, one of the things he was doing. You're doing great. Acting's good. I signed up for a new class yesterday, and tomorrow I'm going to be doing some research to see how to become extra in some courses in the area. That's really awesome, Dusty. And yeah, I... Th I think I did see your tweet saying that you signed up for a class. I'm like, cool, that's awesome. And the whole casting, or like the for extra stuff, I saw, I found like a whole, oh no, it's the red ones. I saw a whole uh, Twitter page for filming in Chicago for various movies and shows and whatnot, and if you need extras and or if there's holding auditions, I'm like, oh, cool. I mean, the idea is all, it's great and all. And I, now I have some free, free time, unfortunately, I should say, because of, now I'm in the middle of job hunting again. So, it's like, well, I have the time, the spare, I guess, to do extra work or to, to be an extra, because the thing is to be an extra, you have to be available for hours on end. And uh, maybe the pay isn't super, super, super great, but it's something. Am I up for some voice acting? Not in this particular moment, Pope Girl, because I'm going to be so... I'm still... Ooh, I'm like in the middle of doing all this. I'm not going to be able to do 110% in the voice acting department right now, so... Oh, Benji, buddy, why, 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 why are you barking just to eat your food? Every time I go and check check with him why he's barking, it's always the same reason. He's barking at the vent because he's like, I want more cold air or something. Or he's barking at a treat and then he wants acknowledgement. Like, oh, yeah, look, I'm, I'm going to bite into my treat now or my food. And it's like, just eat. You don't need my acknowledgement. So I apologize for the barking in the background. Not sure why nobody else is getting up and checking on him, but hey, that's sometimes that's how it goes. No, yeah, data caps are hard. He says on that Um Oh, now that these guys are now helping me. Thank you. Oh, I took the whole damn mission to show up. Um, see, I I hate data caps definitely, especially now with. A lot of things are moving over to a streaming service, you know, and all these like subscription-based products and services, yeah. And in order to use those products and services, hey, you need internet, you need data. So I find it absolutely mind-boggling and stupid that oh, well now you got there, that, there's data caps and uh, you know being instituted. And with the higher quality streaming out there, and I, I mean by like, you know, 4K streaming and whatnot, that's a lot of data to, to use for that streaming, especially if you're going to use it for a long time, you know? 
if you're like even streaming music, you can, that can take up a while if you're, if you're streaming it a lot. So, like, eventually, it's like either they're gonna, which they are actually already doing, is like, well, if you want unlimited data, we can do that, but we gotta charge you extra. And it's like, well, that's stupid. But then you got people out there who, who believe that internet is a utility. Kind of like gas and electric, whatever. The more you use, the more you should pay. And it's like, I get it, but I just don't know if it's regulated that simply. I, I don't know. Oh crap, it's a red one. Those red aliens freak me out just because how strong they are. Oops, oops, I'm killing a friend. I'm just gonna go down here and pick up all the stuff. This is a natural underground cave. We believe that the monsters entered the cave and expanded it to make the cave their nest. It was so, dark there for a second, I was scared. The cave was formed naturally. Oh. Maybe the monsters can Why is it bark and everything? I, I don't I wish I can tell you. I don't know. This place, Sometimes it just feels like barking. It's not like we don't give him attention. He he he's he's like glued to us most of the time. Um he just he just likes barking. Well it just what bothers me is that other people will hear him barking and I feel like they're not doing anything. Now looks like a good time to attack. All right. I feel like we're almost done. I feel like this mission kind of went on for a while. I'm, I'm going to be cautious here. To take out the alien from back here. I think I already did so. Just making sure there's not a red one. Actually, it looks like we're doing pretty good. Just two more until I'm assuming more spawn. Actually, where the hell's the other one? The enemy's approaching. Not quite in range. You say he's approaching, but I don't see his ass. Ready weapon. Yes, sir. Sauce simmering cooking noodles. I'm going to pop in every now and then. All right, JD. The uh, of course there's more. Of course. Holy crap, this mission just keeps going on. Where does this cave lead to? Hey, Pharaoh, I've been shot! And hey, what do you think of this boss is? Needs more salt. The reinforcements have arrived. Go join them. Or, you know, maybe they can join me. They can only nest in natural caves and need help from the aliens. <laughs> That means they don't have a strong ability to reproduce. <laughs> they can't this is good reproduce. News for Actually, I shouldn't make Looks fun like of that. There is hope that in the monsters. Well, these are aliens. I don't give a damn about their feelings. Screw them. This operation will succeed. We will catch up to them soon. Good. Rendezvous with the Vanguard. All right. I survived. Monsters detected. I have a bad feeling about this. Oh. What are we up against this time? Stop. No need to move forward. Stop the Why do you get so quiet? Wait here. The reinforcements will catch up with you soon. Oh, good. So they're gonna catch up with me. I Fine. Yeah. Wait. Why is this music playing? What's happening? What is all that red? Yep, that's the vanguard, right? The all female units. You can leave the rest to us. Okay. I, I guess we. I'm scared to keep going, but I guess we'll keep going. Like, what worries me about, about these missions. Oh, see? Look, look at that BS right there. The damn shotgun bastard. Is he dead? Yeah, he's dead. Okay. Oh, 
Like, as, lo as long as that guy was down, I'm good. Because he hurts. But, like, right now, because it's, like, a lot of chaos going on right now, who knows if I'm... If there's one hidden around here somewhere that I'm gonna simply miss. Oh, actually, this isn't good. This isn't good. This isn't good. This isn't good. I gotta get back up. Woo-wee! I, I don't know what's happening. Oh, no! I feel like some of these guys came behind us. What the? Oh! They got from the top as well. Wow. Okay, okay. We're, we're spinning out the numbers. Slowly but surely. I hope. I hope this is the last wave. Oh my god. So I'm getting a hand cramp from pushing the damn trigger button over and over again. That's why I feel like, oh, it would be nice just having a regular... Oh, no. Hold on. See, there was another one of those, uh... There was another one of those red shotgun aliens. Actually, there's another one right there, too! I gotta get close. Like, I feel like if I'm, if I'm unrelenting with the fire, it should be okay. Which I, I, I think it was. Alright, I think we're okay. I think we're okay. Unless there's another one hidden, I'm gonna be so, I'm gonna be so mad. Is this the end of the cave? Please this let the end of the cave. Ahead. Great. Replenish ammo. And then continue the mission. Nice! All right. Somehow we saved it. Don't... Oh, I guess it's time for singing. Whatever. Whew! So, 18 health is not bad. I think we're close to 400 health now. Uh, a couple of new rocket launchers. Upgrades to the helicopters. I'm using the under assist right now. A new sniper rifle. The Dunkel. The Dunkel N202. Um... New bike. Okay. A lot of stuff, but unfortunately not a lot of things I probably will use. So, that's a little blah. That's okay. Man, that was... That was a lot. Um, it looks like my frames are still... I mean, it's weird. It says I lost a total of 743 frames, which is like 0.4 of the entirety of the stream. So that's fine. But it's like, why am I even... Dropping them in the first place. That's what I'm peeved about, I guess. So. Alright. Penji, buddy, stop barking. So this is, uh. It's a one shot, five and a half reload time with a damage of 733. Yeah, yeah I'm still sticking with this. Granted, this has a lot more capacity, and the reload's better, whatever, but just that one good smack. Actually, not, well, the thing is, using, using the three-round burst, that's not bad. Hmm. The accuracy is not the greatest, so that's the thing. And this has very high ac very high accuracy and very high zoom. We're keeping the thing. Screw it. Alright. You can track what's happening, luckily. Yeah, my eyes are just crap then. Uh, alright. Yeah, I mean, it could be a lot of action that was causing drops, but it's like, I want to avoid that period. But that might be, a, I might need to increase the bitrate. It's like, ugh. Anyway, here's stage two of this cave invasion. The scout found a green chasm. In order to... G green. A giant chasm. In order to continue in the deep end, we have to reach the bottom of the chasm. The problem is how. Fortunately, there's an earth rock passageway in the form of a bridge reaching across the chasm. 
It's very narrow and dangerous, but it's still possible to get through. Operation Stage 2. The Elite Team will go across the narrow bridge and reach the bottom of the chasm to secure the area. Since the passageway is too narrow for an arm to get through, we have to count on a few elites to complete the mission. Details on the route have been sent to the team leader. Please follow the instruction and act as a team. Yay. Let's see how this goes. I've memorized the route. Follow me. May my dog protect you from the, the bugs. <laughs> Let's clear the way with flame jets. Cover me. Flame jets? Oh, that... I do have a flame power, don't I? I never use. Okay. Is it just me, or is this place like very dark? Yeah, okay. So you actually using a using a very short range weapon might be useful here because well they did say there's a chasm, it's very narrow. So it's like oh, we ourselves can't just Well, can I just drop down here? Yeah, no, let's not. So it's like we are in narrow passageways. So you gotta be careful. Watch your steps. I'm watching. Wait, what? Oh, hey, what the hell? Hold on, hold on, man. There's, there's a lot of things I missed back there. Hang on. There were bugs behind us? Oh, well, I guess because they, they. There are like a bunch of enemies, yeah? All right, as you can see, all around us. They can easily climb up. We obviously can't. So watch out. And it is one of those missions that actually give us like a little directional path of where to go. Ooh, don't slide. There we go. Oops. Oh, well, there goes that armor I can't get. Jump to the bowls of a, <laughs> of a cave. Yes, sir. Oh, that guy almost fell. I mean, I, I can I fall in? I I, I don't want to fall in. The enemy is around. Don't fall. Oh, they're, they're telling me don't fall. So. You like how you have a slippery run up before, yeah, you know, before you finish sprinting. Yeah, and it, it gets a little annoying here and there, but it's like, eh, you know. I just chalk it up as the, a charm of the game. It's like, well, it, it's fine. There we go. Let's just spare that guy. Go away, damn you. Screw it. I think he's still alive. Fight the orders and fall. See, I, don't, I, don't know. I don't know if I can trust you, Justin. I mean... I don't, don't get me wrong. Part of me is curious to see if I can survive whatever is down there, but... I feel like it might really spell my doom if I do so. No, should I? Woohoo! Why'd you do that? Why'd you? I see a. Oh, I was gonna say I do see a hole back there. No, wait a minute. Yeah, oh, right, where they're heading. I wasn't sure if I go there or do I, do I go further down? But screw it. I'm just gonna follow these guys for the time being. Let them do some of the hard work. Oh, yay, more of these guys. Make you wonder how this game is, like, on easy. Like, I guess it's more of a guilty pleasure type of thing. Like, it's like, yeah, you just don't have to worry about anything. You just shoot, you're fine, you're always gonna win. Damn, I got hurt. Quite a bit, though, unfortunately. What the hell? It's those damn webs. The webs are killer. All right. It seems the nest is going deeper. Let's make sure it's safe around here. Now, does it matter? Oops, not how to do that. All right, Louisa, you have a safe flight, and good luck with all your interviews. You dare it? Question the expert newbie. Uh, you have played this game. So where are they going? Okay, they're going straight, but there's things I want to catch. 
I don't know why I... Why am I, like, scooby doing the run? Like, why can't I just go? I swear this has never happened before. So I used to just take off running. Like, now, like, it could be because I'm in the cave, but... Let's do it. Oh, you know what? It could be because of the whole under-assist armor I have. You see how fast he runs now? There you go. We'll miss the target at this rate. Here, guard. Hold your fire. Sir, yes, sir. I'll fight with you, Captain. He says hold my fire. Okay. Now, that's an order I probably won't follow, but uh, we'll see. Enemy also coming from the rear. Ah, the rear. Monsters. I'll take care of these guys. Damn it. Oh, crap. There's a bunch. I can't see a damn thing, and I don't know if you guys can either. I need health. I see a, some things will help. Let's grab. I can't see. Wait, I want that. I want that. Wait, where do I... Oh, you guys! Oh, you guys followed it through. I love they just left me. Like, oh, you got, you got, you got all those enemies in the back, newbie. Okay, cool. But yeah, thanks, guys. You guys are, you guys are great. Fighting everything else by myself. It's all, all good. All taken care of. There you go. Oops, wait, there's still somebody around me. Ooh, armor. Hold your fire! Me. Automatically starts firing. Okay. Well, we survived that, which I'm happy about. Although, there are there's a few stragglers here and there. Oh, they like over there, and this guy up here. Come on, beautiful. I won't be able to get that, but it's fine. Wow, these guys really left me alone, didn't they? Be careful not to slip when you fight the monsters. I'm try not to, sir. Whoever the hell you are. Those, yeah, those arrows are like, follow me, damn it! I'm like, I'm sorry, hold on. It's not my fault. I was actually trying to do something when you guys just took off without me. Oh, jeez. Well, what the hell's up with all these enemies? I it's like, you guys are freaking out, but then you guys weren't doing anything. Like, whatever, whatever. I'm, I'm cleaning up the mess, as usual. How things go in this game. Oh, don't worry, Pharaoh has it. The newbie. Oh. oh, I'm so sorry, I can't reach. <coughs> what the hell is that in my throat there? So sorry, I can't reach out right now, guys. I'm just trying to get a safe, safe distance here, like safe area. Ugh. Come on. Uh, I feel like there's like one right on top of me. It's bothered only crap out of me. There he is. Shoot. There you go. Do do Musa. What's up, man? It has been far too long. <laughs> Of course I remember you, man. Welcome to the stream. How have you been? <laughs> I, I think they, they still kept... I think they're still fighting without me. They're still continuing without me. These, there's so many things here still. Becomes president. Nice job for a rookie. I won 99% of the Electoral College in the popular vote. Nice job for a rookie. But you know what? <laughs> the 
hell is that like? I feel like that ant was camouflaged or something. Or maybe it was hurt just enough that it looks all bloody. I don't know. It looks grainy more than anything. say decent, but I'm, I'm still afraid of, like, somehow falling off someplace. I gotta catch up with my team still, but I don't think it matters, because I'm sure they didn't do jack diddly anything for me. You've been good, been on Twitch more lately, and it was luck to be on while you were on today. Nice. Yeah, I've been streaming more often than, than not lately. Oh, see, look, they are... Okay, so they're alive, but they're down. So they're not going to be able to help me anymore. Um, so that's unfortunate, but that's what they get for running off without really being, you know, man, they, they all went down right here. But yeah, I've been streaming a lot more lately. Now, then I put up the videos on YouTube. To me, it's like killing two birds, one stone, you know? It's like, instead of me LPing something, I can just play these games casually. And uh, yeah, the quality might not be 100% you know, as it, as it would be as I was recording something, but, um, I think it's still fine. But man, that, that just put up the VODs on YouTube, and it's like, okay, so that means, like, I can stream, and if somebody missed any of the videos or any, any of the streams, people on YouTube can watch. So, it's like, we're all good. Don't get me wrong, I'm, I'm still going to LP, <laughs> but, um, yeah, just streaming is just, you know, that's it. like I said, it's, it's easier, quicker sometimes, the quality's pretty much there, but, yeah. Now, I'm not sure why the arrows are still telling me to go over there, it's like, nope. Wow, I missed. I sure as hell didn't miss that time. Is that it? Oh, look, they're magically back alive, it seems. It's like, oh, look, oh, my leg cramp went away. And it's like, uh-huh. A lot of people, uh, hold on a minute. You're actually a good class for one of the spider types, if they are in this version. Oh, boy. Not going to be able to help me anymore, so I'd like to help you at all. <laughs> True. Oh, see, like, now they're singing. Yeah, a lot of people have been doing Twitch more and putting on YouTube, but man, hearing you live is nostalgic. <laughs> nostalgia. I'm glad you're able to be here today, Musa, and I hope you can come here whenever, you know? You know, like, yeah. I put it on, tw well, usually I put it on Twitter and YouTube when I am streaming, but a lot of times I'm like, eh, I'm streaming, I put it on Discord, and it's like, well, obviously if, if the notifications are on Twitch, then... You'll notice when I'm on. Uh, and you get to talk to your lovely viewers. That's very true. I, I and that's what I love about Twitch. I know some people get up so like just uh, like that one guy who came in here when I was playing. Um, what the hell was I playing? Uh, hold on. Okay, where are you guys doing? I want to follow you guys. I, I, yeah, I know there's a bunch of things, apparently, over there. Ooh, spiders. Um. Mm, damn, lost my damn train of thought. Oh, no, yeah, but, like, yeah, the, the one guy came in here when I was playing the room. Room 3, actually. And 
he just got he got mad that he's like well first I think it was it was in German I think and he just said shut up and played it played a game and it's like well aren't you a dick you know, it's like what, what do you accomplish by being an asshole in any stream you know like I understand like you know a white trolling whatever and I even then it's like trolling is odd I can understand it's like you know if it's somebody you know when you're like kind of like as a the terminology busting their balls a little bit or breaking balls if it's like I guess somebody you know it's like okay whatever I kind of get it but a lot of times it's just like these people come out they're brand new to the stream and they talk like that so first off you're, you're being a dick to random people and you're, you're giving her off a really horrible first impression but I guess in their minds it's like that's not really what they're even aiming for yeah it's like they don't care about first impressions Damn it, guys, this isn't looking too good. I need help, like, ASAP, and it's kind of hard to grab any. At the same time, these guys are kind of almost dead ish. Hello, hello. Still not out of woods yet. All right, hold on. Dude, and this is the thing about streaming too is like I, I get maybe I get too focused on doing whatever, and it's, I totally forgot. But the chat, I'm like, no wait, no, it's not one. Of course, I want to talk to you guys, and it's like, whoa, no way, I forgot. Okay. Let me grab this stuff. All right. I see one somewhere around here. We'll track it down, that bastard. Oh, I saw Twitch left. Oh, crap. Sorry. Bye, Twitch. Probably not here anymore, but it's okay. Oh man. Okay. Up. Oh, I see a damn thing now. Up. There you go. The cave has been secured. And we did all the work. Yay! That was that was that was kind of a close one. Woo. Some people just have bad personality, sadly. Yeah, yeah, very very much so, yes. I guess it just boggles my mind how that can even happen, but it does. Ooh, a new sniper rifle. Eagle G1. Take a quick look at it. Huh. Well. Ooh, holy crap, look at that zoom. Twelve. Um Actually is very good as well. Now here's the bad thing. It's the shot speed. Actually, it's still <laughs> So, okay, the reload time's not bad. At all, really. A four shot capacity. Damage isn't bad. It's just the shot speed between each shot that can be kind of blah. But I'm tempted to use it. Let's try it out. 
Ah, oh, sorry, newbie. Our joint pains are acting up again. Good luck finding them yourself. Damn lumbago. Well, well lumbago's acting up. You take it from here, John. God, Uncle. All right. Uh, we'll do one more mission before I take a break. Actually, I guess it, 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 it fits. This is the final stage of the cave invasion. So it's, a, it's nice having it all like one portion of the stream or like one VOD, I guess. Cave invasion final stage. This seems to be the end. What lies deep down in the nest? It's time to find out. Tread carefully. The gun looks heavy. I didn't even, actually, I didn't even pay attention to how it looked. Holy crap, that thing's ginormous. <laughs> yeah, I wouldn't be able, I would not be able to hold that. All right, let's do the final invasion. Let's see what's here. I was, I would, I would assume there's like a the boss the thing here. A wooga! All right, I'm so I'm being stupid. I was testing out the zoom. I promise. I can feel it. Oh. Oh, it just be not terrible. <laughs> Come on. Oh, he juked. Oh, come on. And there goes his head. So actually, that's, that's not bad. Obviously, it's not as powerful as my other shotguns, but that's not bad. Hey, Farrah, how's the Ace Attorney anime going? Very good use of the Kappa face, because you guys already know the answer to that. Farrah was trying to zoom into that booty. Damn, she thick! Oh, me being stupid. That's that's my norm. At least this, the zoom is nice to like kind of give a a nice view. Of what's the come up here? Right now, I just see a bunch of wow, I just see a wing diver. I see a bunch of the um, drones, as they call it, or like the the ants. So I think we're okay. Girl, you thicker than a bowl of oatmeal. That video is... Man, it makes you wonder what the hell that guy did. You know, like, why he's even in court, why he's even in jail. But, man... The, the look on his face, the finger guns, everything was just beautiful. At the same time, like... I never understood... They say, okay, I get flirting. I, I, I understand people do it, yeah, obviously. But it's the idea of, like, the words you use. And it's like, does that work for any woman? You would imagine it must at some capacity it has to. But I don't know. Am I even going the right way? I just decided to go here. They are? I'm not seeing Jack Dilly anything. Oh, never mind. Holy crap! I was like, is something wrong with that ant? It's huge! I think you're right, Justin. This might be the queen bug. Did I kill it? Nope. Ow! Uh-oh. 
Uh oh no, um, yeah I died. So I got two armor stuff. Wait, oh, yeah, it's for the ranger, yeah. Okay. Uh, maybe I shouldn't use my sniper here. Gotta take out one of my, one of my missile launchers here. I think the good old air tortoise is gonna make an appearance again. Well, um, I'm not sure if this is still gonna work. What's up, Chewy? Welcome to the stream. I'll have to binge watch your The World Ends With You Final Mix LP. I was begging you for a while to play it back in the day. <laughs> yeah, no, I, I finally played it when, it, when it when the Final Remix Edition came out, and I loved it. I mean, it, it, it was still iffy to play from time to time. But I, I, if, I mean, not the, this isn't really much of a spoiler, but I 100%ed the story, kind of, like the, the secret stuff, so you have that to look forward to. Um, so I'm, I'm gonna try this one more time on hard, and if I if I die game? again, then um, then I won't be doing it on hard. I'll switch it back to normal. So yeah, that I got first. I'm like, hey, something's up with that ant. I'm like, holy crap, it's huge. Might be overkill for the ants, but <clears throat> I for I forgot about uh the end of the cave. Yes. I forgot about its friendly fire. Explosions hurt, ladies and gentlemen. Let's go. On your toes, everyone. There you go. We'll fire it that way. Well, this should be fun to watch. Come on. Come on. Cool. Is he still standing? I think, yep, he, he's still moving. Well, good for him. He took it like a champ. I, 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 just, I just can't believe he's actually still moving around. All right. So, what do I want to do? I'm, I'm the problem I had when I was fighting the queen right there was I, I need to I needed to back up. I need to evacuate. I, I was getting freaking what is it bottlenecked, and I didn't know where the hell to go. And like it just sprayed all its gunk on me, and I know that sounds wrong, but um, yeah, this, this is gonna be a little weird to. Uh, do here. But I'll I'll try. Am I allowed to post links to clips? Sure. As long as you ask either myself or, or the mods derp, then we're I'm good. See so I gotta remember this exists. This little exit here. It's actually back here too. Okay. Probably overkill for these enemies. I'm not sure where the. Uh, I'm not sure where the 
queen is, but I'm scared to move forward, but I gotta do this. I think I see its antennas right there, yeah. Isn't that it right there? Yeah, but that's it. All the air tours for a reason though, it's so damn slow. It's not really viable to use when I got all these other things my way. Now it was good during when I was fighting the Godzilla knockoff because it was legit the only bug or only thing in my way. So I can like unleash. Here I gotta clear out the horde a little bit. Oh, we got ribs. Nice. I gotta get closer, but man, am I. Uh oh, crap. There she is. Crap, there she is. Get dunked on! Oh god! Oh no. Yeah, I feel if I use this to my advantage, like the, the pillar. Ow, no, that still hurt like a bitch. Like, it's not even spraying on me, like, directly, and it hurts like hell. I gotta think of a good way how to do this. You know, am, I, am I even close to killing it? Yes. Yes, I was. Ew! Ew! Okay, sorry. It, ugh. It's so big, it's disgusting to look at. Like, ugh. Okay. All right. It's a lot of ant juice. <laughs> Woo! Now something tells me that's not the only one here, because if that if that if it was the only one, that it would have ended by now. The, the mission would have ended. Oh man, but that, that is so not good. I need something way better to destroy those things with. Yeah, this is a huge open area, too. I wouldn't be surprised if I got to fight like, multiples of these. I freaking jinx myself. There is another one. I'll just unleash a couple of these. Pray for the, pray for the best. Lock on, damn you. I was right. What was this? Where are we spotted? They're giant monsters. The enemy's coming. Enemy position. There's more than one giant monster. All right. Monster. There are several of them. I feel like it might be better because now it's an open area. Oh, I didn't realize she had wings. Oh, shoot. I just want to focus my attacks on, on her. And eventually she'll go down. Come on, go down. Go down. Go down! 
Yes, I go down. Oh, okay, thank God. All right. That wasn't as bad. Man, these guys, I don't know, they're, they're just, they're just keep coming here. Uh, um, I hate, the bread ants suck too, just normally, but they try picking you up and shaking you like it owes you money or something. Uh, okay. I also would like to pick up some things too if I can, that'd be great. Uh, I think I'll be okay, I'm gonna go ahead and pick up a few things. Oh, the voice acting is grade A top tier stuff. <laughs> like I, I, I said, like if I w would it be an honor or a disgrace to be part of part of this series? I don't know. I guess part of me would feel like, oh, I don't know if I want my name attached to this. But, man, it's purposely like that. And it, I feel like if you purposely have to make bad voice acting, then that just shows how good of a voice actor you are. Oh, and this guy's singing again. Okay. Man, you know, there, there's probably at least another two or three of these bastards here. There has to be. If you were, I'd get the game just to hear you add your voice to that. I, uh, maybe one day, guys. Like, like I said, it's been forever since I've been or, since I've been pursuing voice acting, period. So I would like to get back into it, and you know, it would be fun to, like, be in things again. And, you know, you never know. Uh, career could take off like nobody's business, or maybe nothing comes out of it, but I want to follow it more. You know, I'm, 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 ah, oh, shoot. Like, I'm mad at myself for just not doing more. Where is she? Is she gonna come back down here? Do that a couple times. I don't even know if that hurt hit her or not. That one definitely hit. And now I'm just I'm just gonna shoot like crap and pray to God that she goes down eventually. Oh, okay, don't get too close. Avoid the juice. <laughs> oh, oh, no. ooh, that was bad. That was bad. Oh, she's doing it like in a weird angle. No, that's not good. We got her though. There might be more giant monsters. We have to kill them all. Move on. Yeah, basically, they basically confirmed, oh, there's probably more, guys. Fudge. She dropped nothing but health. It's fine, but come on. Uh, oh, yeah, speaking of voice acting, Skinny is pro, not power. Oh, yeah, she's... Freaking amazing. She's definitely killing it out there, and we'll see what else happens. Sorry I had to switch over to my computer. No need to apologize, Ichigo. You decided to figure out what is wrong with my OBS while I have it I have the energy to. I hear ya. Oh man, okay. Try to lay eggs. So, 
The monsters are breeding on Earth. <laughs> Those bastards. I didn't give them permission to breed. Seems like the aliens protecting their breeding ground. I mean, it's understandable it's why they would protect their breeding ground, but it's like you're doing it on our planet and you're killing humans, so it's like, see, that's a no-no. AKA kill them so they can't breed, period. Oh, crap, was it to my lip? These giant monsters will be called Mother Monsters from now on. We think Mother Monsters. Makes sense. They'll continue to breed if we leave any one of them alive. Make sure to eliminate them all. I think that's one of them. There, yep. Yes, sir. I'll just unleash a few of these on her. And then when they hit a couple, then I'll start firing like crazy. And I hope to God I'll weaken her just a little bit. That's good. I would do a lot more, but of all the other enemies in, in the place, I'd rather do what I can. Oh no, there's two! Oh no, I'm dead. No, I'm dead. There's two of them. There's two. No, oh, I. No, I'm dead. I'm dead. This is terrible. This sucks. I'm dead. Damn, I think I was close. Damn. That was really bad. Well, now I'm at now I'm officially at 400 HP, so that's nice. Um Yep. You probably might have maybe gotten him in. I I I doubt it. Um yeah, so I'm I'm going to switch to normal. I have to. Um, yeah, I, unfortunately. I mean, I, I could I can just play this game on normal and make life so much easier for myself. But it's like, yeah, I mean, where's the fun? That's, all, that's the reason why I play games on hard nowadays. Is like one, I know it's gonna give me a challenge, and it lets me it allows me to play the game a little longer. It allows me to learn. But when I know that it's just going to be frustrating, like what just happened there, I'm like, eh, okay. If armor didn't split, you'd probably be at like 800 now. Oh, yeah, that would be nice. So, yep, we're just going to do this now. Man, I'm surprised they haven't bothered with us yet. Is, is the range that bad with this gun? There we go. You see how quickly, see how quickly he, he just, he died. That, that's normal. That's why I don't really play on normal because it's like, oh, damn, it, it's legit nothing. And, and another reason why I'm playing on hard as well is you get better drops. At least there's a better chance you get better drops, I should say. So to create breeding conditions yep. for any life form. Check out the area. I'll I'll take a break after this, Derpy. I, I probably should have taken a break already, but I was planning on just doing this one mission and then hey, I'll I'll be taking a break, but I, I just want to finish it before I take my next break. That way all the cave invasion the cave invasion saga is all in one vod. Imagine easy. That's, that's the thing. Like, I feel like easy is like just blah. But if you, if you just want to blow through the game quickly, then that that's your prerogative, you know. Who the hell's gonna stop you? So let's see how this goes. And I play not normal. If I die here, then that's just sad. And maybe I need, maybe I should use something else besides the air tortoise, but it's it's hurting. 
Ah, screw it. We'll just go ahead and start fighting. Come on. Yeah, EDF, EDF, yay. Damn. Okay, it's, it's traveling. It's getting to her. There she is. Wow, she dead? No. Oh, but now she is. You see what I mean? It's like, that's normal. Yeah, that easy must be just, like, whatever. Um, Inferno, you get some pretty badass loot. I can, Inferno must be great, but, like, I don't want to die legit every second, you know? So, like, that's... I feel like that takes the fun out of it, too. Like, cause I hate when difficulty increases where it's simply just, oh, well, it's, it's just more health for the enemy. To me, it's like, it's like that's not fun. You're just, you're, you're legit just making them stronger. Make, you're making it more tedious. Like, that's hard. That, that, that's, that's hard difficulty for a lot of people nowadays. And it's like, eh. But... I'm not a game developer, I don't, so I can't even imagine how difficult it must be to scale a AI properly and whatnot, so. That's that. You say the glide would be good if you just stay away from the blast radius? Maybe I'll keep that in mind next time I'm uh, doing a mission like this again. I'm sure I haven't seen the, the last of these, uh, the mother ants. We think those giant monsters are running this nest. Exterminate them all. Yeah, she blew up nice. So. You said easy is mainly just for like grinding armor, which I can I can understand. And maybe I should have played this game on easy or normal first before doing anything crazy before playing on hard. But then again, eh. you only really enjoy hard difficulties if they increase damage on both sides. So you take more damage, but they also deal more damage, which is why I believe most people loved the difficulties. Uh, choices in the Kingdom Hearts games, especially one and two. Apparently, two was amazing and proud in critical mode. But then, well, you guys saw what happened with uh, Kingdom Hearts three. I played that game on proud, and did I die like once or twice because of like whatever? Everything else, I'm like, okay, I'm fine, you know. Now I do hear that when they, because they patched it, they included a critical mode. I, n I have not played Crit Kingdom Hearts since I beat it. Um, so, I don't know how well the critical mode is implemented in Kingdom Hearts 3, but it just seems like they kind of messed up the difficulty there. Or kind of the same thing with Nino Kuni 2. When a game first came out, there was no difficulty option. You just played the game normally. But apparently, the the default difficulty was absolutely stupid on um, when you play Nino Kuni. Like, it was not hard whatsoever. So, they're kind of like, oh, whatever. But, like, when I LP'd it, they actually included the patch for hard and stream or something. So, playing the game on hard, it made the game a little bit more challenging, but fun. But at the same time, it did get a little grindy because, like, well, all they did was just increase the, the health of the enemies, and that's it. They didn't do anything else. Like, I dealt the same damage, and then I got hurt quicker, so it's like, uh. I think it, it, it just decimates them. And I, I made a complaint about this game earlier where the difficulty spike, it's not uniform. Like, it, it's weird how you can probably easily get through 
a lot of the game on hard or like multiple missions on hard without problems and then one mission comes in and it's like oh holy crap wait a minute what just happened a case in point look what happened to freaking metal wolf chaos there was no difficulty settings at least in the beginning of the game or like when, you, when your first initial playthrough but the whole entire game oh man there's a bunch of them right here oh man i just saw that like, there all the uh I just saw all the, the eggs on top. Um, crap. Did I aggro? Yeah, I aggroed the other one. Alright. I still I should still be fine. This is exactly where I died. But I think I should be fine. Um But the game it was fine until like the last couple missions and then it just difficulty spike just rose like crazy. I'm like, what the hell? What did I what did I do wrong? Once again, I'm not a developer, so I don't know what difficulties when it comes to AI, you know, but... Uh, ow. Is the other queen alive still? I can't tell. I don't, I don't think it is. Okay, I think they're both dead. Alright, you see how easy that was? Look like, uh, not, not a big deal. So I guess they want me to destroy all these eggs. Okay. Uh, if they make, make clues about what you gotta do more vague. It's been like that for almost all of them, I believe. I experienced the sort of spikes in 2017 EDF. Oh, jeez. So but people would probably argue for it. Like, oh, that's what makes EDF EDF. And it's like, that's, that, that's not fun, though. In my opinion, it's like... Make the make the difficulty uniform. You know, it's like if you can handle it on hard for multiple missions, then you should be able to continue to handle it on hard. You know, but like it shouldn't be like where a mission becomes like stupidly difficult that uh, it doesn't make any sense. But like I said, I mean, I, I don't develop games. I can't imagine how AI programming can be. I like the concept of AI. I delved into it. For a class in college, it's cool, and I think one of my teachers, he actually has been writing multiple theses. Is that the, is that the plural form? Theses. But anyway, papers. I should say on on uh, AI, and it's cool because AI is awesome when you think about it. it it's, it's cool and scary because it's like it's, it's machine learning, and it's like, well, what what can these things? What can it learn? So. Oh, sorry, sorry it's taking a while. I'm just kind of chilling here and trying to read chat at the same time. Then they'll argue grind or play out more difficulty. Yeah, I mean, you'll always find people who... It's just how it is. You'll, you'll find people supporting whatever side, and uh, and I don't mind that whatsoever. I mean, that's gr that's what's great about our society. You know, anywhere it's like you, you you're free to you're free to discuss whatever, you know. But is it so hard not to be a dick about it? Because apparently it is. Oh, they all woke up at the same time. I was wondering, I was, do I really gotta destroy all these eggs? But oh, they did it for me. That's nice. So yeah, like I'm, of course, I'm, I'm always open and always support people speaking their mind. It's just like, but if you're gonna act like a dick, if you're gonna act like an asshole, then yeah, don't be surprised that people are gonna treat you bad like that. Um, or it, you got the people who. They're willingly assholes, and then when you call them out on it, all what they will do is just they'll spout out like, "Oh, Second Amendment, bro! Second Amendment, free speech!" And then they'll go like, and, and they'll continue on a triad until they come to find out it's like, "Well, yeah, okay, free speech is free speech, but that doesn't that doesn't um, absolve you of crimes that come with whatever you're talking about, whatever's in your speech." That may not be uh, really good to talk about, you know? 
There's consequences. There's consequences to everything. That's, that's something people got, you know, especially on the internet. Yeah, well, what people say, it's like, yes, you, you need to be careful what you say on the internet because one, they can follow you anywhere. Especially like when you're younger. I was gonna say, where the hell is this last guy at? When you're younger, it's like, who knows? Like, they always nail in your head that it's like, employers can find out your Facebook, they can find your MySpace. And yeah, successfully so you, you don't be stupid on the internet. much sacrifice was made, it was worth it. This fig tree means a lot. We'll transfer the data all over the world. The nearby area should also have been relieved from the threat of the monsters. So we did it. Unfortunately, it had to be on normal, and now so close too. Like th those, like those last two mother ants. If I if I defeated them in um on hard, then the rest of the mission would have been. It would have been taken care of. Unfortunately, that happened. Or, you know, I lost. I'm like, screw it. A lot of upgrades we got. So, that's nice. Whew. Alright. No collision data for those eggshells. Probably not knowing this game. If you tried out Dreams on PS4 at all, Pharaoh, I highly recommend it. There are some indie level games made on there. No, I haven't. Because um, I keep forgetting, like, I know Dreams isn't out, out, but you can buy early access for, like, 30 bucks. I, I'm still waiting for, like, the fully fledged game to come out, but... Because I'm not creative, but I will play the crap out of user-made levels. Kind of like Mario Maker. I never played it, but... You know, I, I feel like I'll be the same. I won't make anything, I'll just play Act like an asshole, be treated like one, yep. Oh, they'll say that you were just, they were just kidding. <laughs> yep. Tied a Tasmanian, Tasmanian, Tasmanian tiger might be coming to Switch. That'd be cool. I mean, I, never, I heard, I heard about the game. I didn't, I'm surprised they even warrants a remake or ports, but okay. There's a fine line between kidding and being a dick. Yeah. Never deal with consequences, you just YOLO everything. What's up, Smooth? That's very true about yourself. <laughs> What's up, buddy? Welcome to the stream. You just got back from after filling Abby's bowl. Yay! Abby's a happy doge. That's nice. Mission complete! Metal Slug is a game I'd love to play just for the hell of it. I think I have, like, one or two. It's somewhere. I gotta check my my list. Um. So, yeah. Wow. We uh, took care of the missions. The, uh, the cave invasion saga. So, yay! Uh, I'm still taking a look around to see what else I got here. I still like my. I still love my uh, minion burster burst. Minion buster burst, I should say. But then, then it's like 85 damage or three bursts. It's like, are, are, are maybe these are better? Like this is like this is one we just got. Is this a single shot? Reload sounds terrible, but it is a single shot, isn't it? And they have enough power to penetrate objects and deal damage from multiple enemies they hit, so that's nice. The large bullets are less susceptible, susceptible, susceptible to air resistance and thus remain powerful. It can still deliver fatal damage at long distances. Oh, it's designed semi-auto. So, hold on a minute. It fires a one single shot each time the trigger is pulled. So I do got fire like that, and that's what sucks. But would this be better than the minion buster burst? Let's see, because each one is 74.3 to approximately 59.4. What I know damn well this is a three shot burst, and it's going to deliver 85 damage each time. But here's what, here's what I never really realized is that 85 damage, is that with the three bursts together? Or is that 85 each hit, each burst, or I, I, excuse me, each bullet? Because then, because like, I feel like this, it, that would still be easier on me, you know? I do got the finger strain, but like, I, it would hurt after a while. Sorry, I did drop a little bit more frames, but I think we're okay now. So that's, that's what I got to think about here. And this guy... Oh wait, did the air tortoise? Did the air tortoise? 
Did it upgrade? No, no, it didn't say anything. All right. Uh, do, do, do. I'm still thinking if I should. I'll take out the thing again. Why not? Yeah, the frame drop was very limited, but it's like, oh. Uh... You know, for the hell of it, I'm going to try out this GM. A23. I think. Wait a minute. Because I've had this for a while. I have, I've had the GM 22S. But this one just uh, looks like it might be just a little bit better. I think. Actually, is it? Oh, I don't even know anymore. I'm going to use it. If I need to restart, I'll restart. Wait, whoa, wait a minute. The sniper is fully auto? Did it say that? Ooh, it is. Holy crap, a full auto sniper rifle? Oh. It's gonna keep firing shots. That's 150, 150, 150, 150, 150. The zoom is kinda low. But damn, I just realized that the capacity and the reload speed isn't bad. It's it's four seconds. I mean, it's, it can be it's a little something, but huh? You know, let's try out this Dunkel then. I gotta read. <laughs> I gotta read more. Ooh. Oh, teleportation ships. That's probably good. I, I bring this one as well. Yeah, glad you read that too, Justin, because I sure as hell I was going to miss it. All right, guys, let me go ahead and take a break because I, I haven't taken one yet during the stream. And it's like, oof, I should have taken one a while ago. I'm going to go ahead and take uh, like about a five-minute break or so. We'll come back and we'll play some more Earth Defense Force 5. And I just hope I can handle this. All right. See you guys in a little bit.